Dear friends, welcome to Dental Education Hub YouTube channel. Uh, today we are going to study histology of human oral mucosa. So this is a low magnification image, histological image of the oral mucosa. This part is the epithelium. So this part is the epithelium. This part is the epithelium. So this is the epithelium and this part is the connective tissue part. So the mucosa it comprises of two parts, epithelium and the connective tissue. So the epithelium it basically comprises of various layers of cells and the type of epithelium in the oral cavity is stratified squamous epithelium. This is the connective tissue part and the connective tissue part it comprises of various cells such as fibroblast and that produce collagen fibers. There are blood vessels and the minor salivary glands. Now let's see this the same histological image on a higher magnification. This is the epithelium. So this is the epithelium as we have already discussed. And this epithelium, it comprises of various layers of cells. These cells, they are the basal cells. So all these cells, they are the basal cells. And the basal cells, they have a cuboidal or columnar shape. And the nucleus, they are very prominent because there is active cell division. And the most of the cell division, it occurs in the basal layer. So these cells are cuboidal and the, with prominent nucleus. Now, above the basal layer, there are, there are cells which are ovoid in shape. So these ovoid shaped cells with oval nucleus, you can see these are the outlines of the cells, prominent nucleus. And this layer is above the basal layer. This layer is known as the prickle cell layer. Just above the prickle cell layer, there are slightly flattened cells. So these are the slightly flattened cells. You can see over here, these are the slightly flattened cells. And we call these cells, here's another cell, slightly flattened cell. And these cells are known as the intermediate cells, cell layer. So this layer is the intermediate cell layer. Now, this is the topmost layer. And we call it as superficial cell layer. And these superficial cell layer, it comprises of nucleus. Here is another nucleus. This is another nucleus. Nucleus, it is very smaller in size as compared to the basal layer, as compared to the prickle or the intermediate layer. So the superficial layer, it comprises of nucleus and very flattened cells. So this is a known keratinized mucosa because the, uh, the superficial cell layer, it has nucleus. So this is a known, these are the layers that are present in a known keratinized oral epithelium. There is a basement membrane below these basal cell layer and this bas basement membrane is usually not visible in the H&E stain. So it is not visible over here. Now this type of, now this type of epithelium, which is a known keratinized epithelium, it is present on the soft palate, alveolar mucosa, buccal and the labial mucosa the ventral surface of the tongue and on the floor of the mouth. So these are the locations where the known keratinized or the lining epithelium it is present. Now this part is the connective tissue part. So this whole area below this epithelium is the connective tissue part. And connective tissue part, it comprises of various cells uh, such as these fusiform cells these fusiform cells. So these fusiform cells, they are known as the fibroblast. And these cells, the, the, these cells, they produce collagen fibers. 
Now, there are, just in the connective tissue, there are minor salivary glands that are present. So, in the next window, you can see now, uh, these, this is a higher magnification image of a complete minor salivary gland. And these minor salivary glands, they are named according to the location, such as buccal gland, uh, palatal glands, or the labial glands. Now, this is the blood vessel, and it supply nutrients especially to the epithelium because the epithelium it is avascular it do not this epithelium it do not have any blood vessel blood vessels and these blood vessels this supply to the epithelium and also to the adjacent connective tissue thank you very much for watching do give us your feedback in form of likes share and comments thank you again and stay blessed